The Summit Family Fox! <laughs> <laughs> Hi, this is Rhiannon, or Mommy, and this is Nyla from the Simmons Family Show. And today we are going to do a toy review of, what are these called? Calico Critters. Calico Critters. Um, Nyla loves the Calico Critters and uh, she just started collecting them around um, the holidays. So these are some of her first ones. She has one other set and a couple of other little um, puppies. I think the yellow labs, right? Right. So we're going to be doing, and, and we'll see how this goes with um, a little one, uh, who is three. We have a couple of sets we're going to do. Um, this is the Border Collie family. This is the Complete Furniture set. This is a little tiny dog on um, a little rocking horse, which is adorable, so we'll show you that in a second. And this is a girl's bedroom furniture set. Um, so I said complete furniture set, but this is a children's bedroom. So uh, we'll take a look at those here in a second. Let's go ahead and open uh, these. So do you, do you like playing with these calico critters? Yeah, yeah they're a lot of fun, right? Yeah. Even her older sister, who's nine, almost nine, really, really, really enjoys playing with these. Um, this one came in a little carrying case, which is adorable. So you can carry it, excuse me, carry it around. And um, here, let's show them what it does. So if you put it down, um, and put, put the little animal that's sitting, and some of the animals are in sitting position, you can put them on, and it rocks back and forth. And it's really easy, easy to do. It's very, very, very cute. So we'll leave that over there. And then the next one we wanted to do was the um, border Cod border collie family. And um, I did already. I wanted to see how easy it was to open. So that's why one's kind of wiggling around in there. Um, but this is. Oh, you want to show them? Hang on, I want to show them what's in here. Yeah, you turn turn her around. Well, let's just open it so we can see. Cause uh, she's backward now. Yeah, can we open it? Okay. There's four opposable figures in here. These are called calico critters. I want to open it. Cloverleaf corners. They have a lot of detail. They're they're kind of fuzzy. They're very 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 cute. I'm gonna slip the package off to the side uh, so we can get these guys out. I need the scissors. I want to do it. Okay. Um. Okay. So this one is a little girl. I need purple it. dress here. Yes. I've got scissors right here. I need. Okay, she needs kid scissors apparently, which is probably best. Okay, you can do it. So, while she's opening this forcefully, I will show you or talk to you a little bit about the characters. So, in each of the packages we have opened them before um, are, and this is going to be very small, so you're probably not going to be able to see it. Um, it shows you all the play sets on one side, um, and there are quite a few. We saw a really cool tree house at Toys R Us the other day um, that we want to get. It's really, really neat looking. Um, yeah, it's called the Adventure Tree House. They have, they have a luxury home, and they have all of the bedroom sets. She's getting out some of them. Um, and then this shows all the families and all the characters, which you can see, even if it's not close up, how many different calico critters live in this little cloverleaf corner. Uh, it does say on here that um, you can find them on Facebook at facebook.com backslash calico critters. And you can also visit them online at calicocritters.com. There's also a little panda family, um, or panda babies, that she has. Actually, I'll pull those down because they are absolutely adorable. Um, this is one of the baby pandas. It's a little girl, and this is a little boy who crawls. The little boy has a little bottle, and the little girl has a really tiny, tiny pacifier that we've already misplaced that we have to find. Um, so I would recommend not getting these for any child any younger uh, than three or four. I believe it does say it does say that there's a ch choking hazard not for children under three years old. Um, Let's open it. Definitely would not get these for any kids that are any younger. Open it. I want it too. Okay, this one is open. So the first set we're going to open is the children's bedroom set. Careful. Ooh. 
And it looks like there are 25 accessories included in this bedroom set. I don't know. I, don't know. I know you like to open things, but can we come on and help you a little bit? Excuse me for a second, we got a scissor crowd here. Scissors, where did you go? Scissors. Sorry. Be careful opening that, that you don't cut the thing or cut yourself because they're little tiny pieces. So if you unroll this, as you can see, there's super tiny pieces. I'm just going to kind of set things up here so that you can see them as we open them. Oh my goodness, this is so cute. Okay, so this is like a little... Um, a little dresser or like armoire or something like that and all of these little tiny drawers open which are adorable there's even a little one up here and it opens so Nyla's dropping things over here so let me take a look at what we got as she opens it I'll kind of show you what we have here um, the little drawers are super cute because you can put things in them um, these are the children's beds, it looks like. So I don't know if you can see those, uh, the little beds here um, that the children can sleep in. Uh, and they have some bedding, which she's opening now. And they also have little teddy bears for them. I'll put one up here. Super cute. I'm going to figure out what this is here. Okay. Um, it looks like this is a pencil holder. These are tiny little pencils. How adorable. So there's a pink one and a yellow one. And this is a pencil holder. I'll hold it up. I know this is kind of hard to see. And this is a little tiny ruler. So this is their little pencil and ruler set. Which again are super small. Easy, easy to lose. Um, easy to swallow. So you have to be very careful with that. Um, and I may have to look at the instructions to see. Oh, this is actually a bookend. So it looks like we may have some books coming out somewhere at some point. Put a little teddy bear here. It looks like this is a bookend for some books. So hopefully we'll find those soon. And it looks like it is supposed to come with those. And again, like I said before, visit them at www.calicocritters.com. Oh my goodness, so on one side it shows the beds being separated, um, but it looks like they can also be bunk beds, which is what this ladder is for. Adorable. And there's a ladder. There's pillows. That you put on here uh, I need to put for the bunk beds. There's pillows, she's saying. So sorry, standing up here to have it. Okay. Oh. And oh. knocking down our border party collar family. Sorry, guys. Whoopsie. So this is um, why the ladder is in here. I'm going to take it down so we can make the beds a little easier when there's no. Not one on top of the other here. Found the books. But it looks like somewhere in there there must be some stickers. So we'll have to find those, hunt those down. Here is the bedding. So this is the pads for the bed. This is the mattress pad. And that's I need to this is a mattress. Do you want to do it? Okay. Show them how easy it is to make the bed. So there's that. There's the pillow. So I'm going to look in the packaging um, just so we can figure out where there might be. Aha! We left something in the box. Okay, I'm going to have Nyla cut it open for me. So this is the bed. Oh, cute. This is the little um, blankets that go on the beds. And the little tiny scissors. So you kind of have to wrap There's it around. There's the little scissors. Right here, baby. Mm -hmm. 
sorry, you're going to have to bear with us for these, um, these video reviews. Uh, video reviewing with a nine-year-old, a um, little easier than video reviewing with a three-year-old. So, uh, yes. sorry, it takes a little longer to open things and to get through things because, you know, as with any three-year-old, they're a little demanding and want to do things themselves at this age. They're very, um, they're learning independence, let's say. So, okay, we found, um, it looks like the little stickers, the little decals. Uh, so, there, it looks like there's a little schedule chart here that says Monday, there's art, PE, geography, history, and English. Uh, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday has a whole schedule. Okay, hold on, wait, we gotta finish this one real quick. Um, these are the decals for the books, which we will put on probably later. So it looks like in on the box they have this little schedule uh, on the wall of probably the house, um, which we don't have yet. And then these little stickers wrap around the books, um, and it looks like some of these other little decals go on this this part of the set. Um, and I don't I don't think we should cut these out. There are little notebooks, um, pretend notebooks that they have on the floor. Uh, this is a pretend junior math book, music book, um, some postcards, and some other cute little items here. So I'm going to get this cleaned up. We're going to come back and actually do another video on the girls' bedroom, which looks like a lot of fun. But there's also 25 accessories. There are 25 accessories in this one, so I'm going to get this cleaned up. We'll be back. Just a short break, so um, see you in just a second. Thanks. Okay, we're back. Um, I got everything cleaned up from the children's bedroom. Calico Critters is what we're doing, and um, now we're going to do the girls' bedroom for Calico Critters, which looks really cute, very pink, like my nine-year-old's, almost nine-year-old's birthday, or birthday, bedroom, you know, birthday, bedroom, same thing. Um, the characters that are pictured on here do not come with this. It's just the bedroom accessory, bedroom and accessories. Um, this is for three-year-old and up because there are some small pieces. And this is Nyla over here again. She's working on opening the the bedroom set for us. Um, I know I said this at the beginning of the video a couple times, but you can visit them on Facebook. Um, I believe it is on here somewhere. Well, I know their website is um, www.calicocritters.com. I think I said that before. Uh, There's so many sets and so many different things. So she's going to work on opening the bags. Be very careful, okay? Don't touch yourself. This looks like an armoire. Um, oh, and it's so cute. It's got some detail on the front. This is some floral detail, some pink floral detail. And then you open it up, and it has some... Um, space in there for clothing. It's actually got a clothing rack. If you can see, I'm sorry, it's very small. It's got a mirror here, which is adorable. Um, so that's the armoire. I'm going to close them. Actually, close them both so we can set them out. She's opening all of the bedding and stuff over here. Hang on a second. We'll show them what it does, okay? It's going to take us a minute to figure this out. This is a little vanity. Oh! And yes, the vanity drawer does open. And it looks like this is the little girl's bed. And a night table or a side table. This is the, what I'm opening is, um, can you open this for me now? Can you use this okay. to open it? I got it. Okay. These aren't actually too bad to open, um, except for when you do that and you lose all the little pieces on the floor. So. I am going to go down there and get them. This is the seat for the little vanity, and it's kind of cushy on the top. Oh, and there's room. That was fine, you know. Oh, my word. <laughs> Doing a review with a three-year-old. Uh, recommend it. This is a um, little chair for the vanity, and it's, it's soft on the top. And then there's actually storage room on the inside, which is very cute. Um, so that's the seat. I literally hear tiny pieces falling on the floor as I speak. 
Um, again, I'm going to say not for any child under three years old because this is probably the minimum age. So um, I am having a little help here from my other daughter to get these pieces because they are very small. So some of these pieces, and if you can see them, great. If you can't, I'm very sorry because they are literally so tiny. I'm going to kind of just set them up here where they go. There's a little brush. This looks like a little powder box. This looks like a little alarm clock. And there may be some decals and things for these okay. two. You want to make the bed? Yes. Alrighty. So, let's see what's trapped here. Here's the pillow. There's a little doily, actually. Look at this tiny little doily. How cute! For the nightstand. Ah. Let me get it to stand up here. I think there's a decal that might go on this alarm clock. I'll have to find. There's a little basket. This looks like a little suitcase. I don't know if it opens. Let's see here. I love the detail on these. So great job to um, the Calico Critters creators. Uh, these are so cute and so great. I would have loved to have these when I was a little girl. In fact, I like playing with them now. But this is a little suitcase. It's got a lot of detail on it. It actually does come with some clothes and hangers. Um, and this is a little tiny perfume bottle. This looks like um, some sort of cosmetic bottle as well. This is a fingernail polish. And again, the drawer opens, so you don't have to keep all these things on top of the vanity. Um, it looks like... Oh, bless you. Oh, this is a dress, so can you put it on the hanger? Oh, she's already getting things on hangers. There's a dress here. We, we just opened that Border Collie, Border Collie family, if I could talk. And um, some of these dresses will probably fit on them. Some of the bigger characters, not the babies. Um, but again, there is a little place to hang the clothing in here. So we'll try to hang these up and show you what it looks like if I could get them in here. These are definitely for little hands. Can I see that dress? Can we hang that one up? Let's see here. This is a purple dress. What's your favorite color? Purple. Purple. That's right. That's mommy's favorite color too. So let me see if I can get this one out and then I'll show you what it looks like inside. Oh gosh. I'm dropping other things. This is the Assistant, assistant. <laughs> okay. So if you open it up, you can see that there's a, some clothing hung inside here. Oh, thank you. Look at there's magic hands coming out. Oh, we found a lipstick. Here's the tiny lipstick. Oh my goodness, it is so tiny. And actually the detail and the painting on the lipstick is really, really, really good. Um, this looks like a tiny water bottle. I'll have to see if that's really what it is. It doesn't look like a cosmetic bottle. It looks like a water bottle. Um, oh my goodness, this is slippers. There are tiny little slippers with lace detail. Sorry, I'm getting a little excited about these things. Um, oh, this looks like a little tray maybe for the water. And this is a uh, picture frame. Again, I think if I look over here, there's probably um, some decals that go on these little items. Yes. In fact, this little tiny itty bitty circle, if you can see, that I'm pointing to right now, is actually the face of the alarm clock. So um, that's going to take some precision, probably some tweezers to put on. Um, you'll want to be really careful putting that on. So I'm not going to, I'm not going to fumble around with it right now. I'll do it off camera. Um, and then these look like the pictures um, that go on the picture frame. And it looks like there's a couple other like wall decorations or maybe they go on the side of the armoire. And um, we still got someone working on the bed over here. Let me see how the bed goes here. So there's some clothing. Oh, one of those is a rug. There's a couple of rugs. Nightless. So these are rugs. Are places to sit, um, it looks like. And then you put the little slippers on the rug next to the bed. Let's see what this is. This wraps around and has Velcro, so let's see. 
sometimes it's just easier to look at the box and figure out what some of these things are. Actually, um, I lied. This is not a tray. This actually is a picture frame that goes on the wall. So one of these decals um, it looks like this one, which has a forest, um, actually goes inside this and goes up on the wall of the house. So that is super cute. Uh, I'm sure there are instructions on how to do this. And if not, you can just look at the box and it really does give you um, a great idea on where everything goes and what everything is. It actually looks like we're missing a little car that we may have dropped on the floor. Um, it looks like Nyla made the bed here. Um, again, not sure what this is here. It's got some Velcro on it. I'll have to take a look and see. It almost looks like another pillowcase or something. Um, but this is the little girl's room bed. It's got a pink little mattress. It looks like out of the box you kind of need to flatten it out a little bit. But as it's played with, I'm sure. Oh, we've got someone putting on decals over here. Uh, perfect. Wonderful. So, um, like I said, I think the only thing we're missing is a little car that may have fallen on the floor. Um, but when you're completely finished, this is what the little girl's room actually I'll turn it around. What the little girl's room looks like. It is adorable. And it looks like there's a lot of tiny accessories that are going to be fun to play with. Just have to be careful not to lose them. Again, if you have smaller kids, I wouldn't recommend keeping them in a place that they could get to them. So they're definitely a choking hazard. Um, but what would you say about them, Nyla? You haven't said much. Mommy's just blabbering away. What would you say? Talk to the camera. Um. Do you like calico critters? I sub everything I need to in this bedroom. Yes. Do you like this bedroom? Yes. Are you going to play with it a lot? Oh my goodness, look at her. Good job. She put that picture in the picture frame. She even fixed it. You want to hold it up? Hold it up to the camera. Hold it up. Oh, we gotta get your hands just so. <laughs> she did an excellent, excellent job. Can I have a kiss for that one? Mwah. All right, what do you say? Say. It's already. Yep, yeah, we're all done. There's some more. Oh, I know. These are little um, things that you can put on the wall, but they are a little bit harder to do. So these would be better off camera. Uh oh. So. Oh, we got some spillage. She just wants to play with this. So we're going to go so we can play with our set and um, finish it up. But again, I recommend this. It's a, a lot of fun. Very, very cute. A lot of detail. Um, so visit them online, too, to check out all the sets that they have. What can you say? Can you say bye? Bye. Say bye. bye. Click like. Subscribe to our channel. No. Love you. Give them kisses. Give them kisses. Mwah.